the average person just sees us out working. I don't think they really understand exactly what we do. Hi, my name is Gary Burgess and I am a lineman. Well, I decided to become a lineman back when I graduated high school. My brother, he was already in the power line industry and he was a lineman also, so that gave me an incentive to become a lineman myself. Well, I guess some of the biggest challenges involved uh, storm restoration work, basically having to go in there and figure out what you have and just piece everything back together piece by piece. Several years back in uh, Tuscaloosa, Alabama, during the tornadoes, we saw a, a substation that was just totally wiped out and blown away. That was probably one of the biggest things that really stuck with me. A typical day is basically starting out in the morning at the headquarters. You know, we stretch before work. We go out, uh, we get our assignments from our supervisor. We load the job up, we go out to the job, set up our work area, have our pre-job briefing, and then, you know, we get started to work and do it safely and return home the same way we left, maybe just a little tired. It's relatively a safe job, but when you get away from your safety rules and your procedures, then that's when it gets dangerous. But the best part, you know, is the camaraderie of, you know, of everybody that you work with. Some of your closest friends that you have are the ones that you actually meet on the job. The well, ordinary person, I don't guess, they just do not realize the amount of electricity that we do work with every day. You run across some people that are real appreciative. You do have people that comes out and brings you snacks and drinks and really show their appreciation that makes you feel good. Makes me wanna put that much more effort toward doing my job the way I'm supposed to do it.